Police in Hong Kong fired water cannon and tear gas at protesters on Sunday. Some demonstrators dug up bricks from the pavement and at least one petrol bomb was thrown. The brief clashes followed another day of violence on Saturday when the authorities used tear gas for the first time in over a week. The protests have been going on for three months now. They started as a response to proposed new legislation on extradition but have grown into a fight against what many see as the erosion of the one country two systems arrangement under which Hong Kong was returned to China by the British in 1997. This is the biggest political crisis since that handover. Beijing has warned that more forceful intervention is a possibility and paramilitary forces have been holding drills nearby.